On this video, we are gonna tell you if Crab Island is kid-friendly. Is it approved? Stay till the end and I'll give you a bonus tip, a secret place. in this video I would let you know if Crab Island's for kids. I get a lot of questions in my other video that I did about is this kid friendly and well I guess it really depends on where you park out here if it is kid friendly because I'm sure some spots can get kind of crazy and might see some things that you don't want to see but we're kind of back here on the back side there's not a whole lot of there's fish eating my foot there's not a whole lot of people right now back here and it looks like it's mostly kids that is back here where we're at right now so that's why we picked this section is because it looked a little more kid friendly your kids are gonna love Crab Island. It's gonna be fun. You need to know what to do, how to prepare, and in this video I'm gonna tell you how to prepare your kids for Crab Island. One thing that we have heard and learned that if you go to Crab Island on high tide, when high tide is in the middle of the day, then the water most likely is going to be the clearest because it's pushing all the river water back up the river. a ton of places to rent pontoon boats. They have ones with slides and different things. This year we rented a different place. It was Destiny Adventure or Destiny something. And it was in Fort Walton and it was a lot cheaper. It was like $560. And I hate quoting stuff because the price has changed so much. But it was around $550, $560 for eight hours where a lot of the other places are about $800 for eight hours. And it's only a short 20 minute ride over here, which wasn't bad. And the parking was a lot better over there than over here in actual Destin. I totally think that Crab Island can be for kids of any age. Now, the only thing is, I would say the water is probably three foot 
pie right now and we are going into high tide. So if your kid can't stand up in three foot water, you would want to make sure they have a life vest, a flow, something so they can play around. Otherwise, it won't be as much fun for them if they can't touch out here. We brought Maddie a float when she's floating around and she has absolutely have enjoyed today. <laughs> Is it just a baby? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> a shrimp. about it maybe I shouldn't tell you about this spot because you know it's so cool and private I told you to stay to the end and I would give you the the locals secret spot if you go west like a uh, Fort Walton on the back waterway there's a series of islands a bunch of them and you can just beach out here and party to your heart desires where we rented the boat from said this is where they hang out the locals so if you're not into the Crab Island or you think your kids won't and they want a private beach all to yourself, come down this side.